See what really offends me? New Zealand being the best test team in the world. Yeah, now we're talking. <laughs> <laughs> get around that. Okay, so obviously uh, the first test ended um, towards the end of last week, just before we finished the show. Mitchell Sandler took a great court and bold. Great test win for New Zealand. 4.3 overs left. Took the last wicket. Pakistan doing some great Pakistan stuff. Lost yeah. 6 for 30 in the final session. Mm. Fucking run outs going all sorts. Great but stuff then, like, them. You know, they almost saved the game with an awesome partnership as well. Fold alarm. Yep. Yeah, Rizwan. Yep. And then lost and then 6 for 30. 6 for 30. <laughs> <laughs> so, then, so then New Zealand are now number one test team in the world. This second test is uh, going on as we speak. Kyle Jamison took five for 69 in the first innings. Big rig. Yeah, fucking looks love good. that. Bumping cunts. Look, it's sensational. I love it. Mm. Um, and then, obviously, Cam Williamson's just scored his fucking 18th century this week. Yep. 24th test century now. Him and uh, Henry Nichols, big runs. They're leading. We had a kid recently, and when you have a kid, you come back with more perspective and play better. Yeah. That's what Smith and Danny should do. Interesting. Cam Williamson, now this was before... This morning, so he's since pushed on. But Cam Williamson's last twenty-two innings, he's got fifteen hundred and seventy-three runs at eighty-two. Not bad. Who was he playing? <laughs> <laughs> well, well, poor on the same Shah. He's not really sixteen. Was was going? He's going at five and over, none for one hundred and ten off his twenty overs or some shit. Uh, it doesn't look great for Pakistan, but but New Zealand are so good at home. Got to hand it to New Zealand, man. Also, I mean, they fucking smashed India. How do they do that? Yeah, well, you, you, the, the Australian reflexive mind immediately reflexes. They've got into, second graders playing in that team. All of that sort of stuff, yeah. <laughs> Cricketers have to do so much to be trusted yeah. over about 10 to 15 years. Again, it's the Steve Waugh theory. You know, soon anything New Zealand does, it's going to be, well, who was it against? Oh, where was it? Oh, mm. against that mob. Oh, they don't play mm. well away. Okay. The guys are like literally nearly number one. They win at home all the time. They mm. do beat good opposition. They've made the last two World Cup finals. And they do it. They do it with about fucking three people in the country. Yeah. It's pretty good. Well, that... Um, that Still US, second grade, but... That, yeah. <laughs> it doesn't explain how yeah. second grade they are. Uh, that UAE series where Australia lost handsomely. <laughs> it was uh, a handsome loss. Um, that was a series where Kawaja saved the test match, got 180 or whatever. Uh, great results. And then... New Zealand played like the week after them. They beat them 2-0. <laughs> that was the <laughs> and UAE. We always think, oh, well, they're just not trying. You know, they, everyone gets up for Australia. Yeah. Yeah. There, that must be it. That must be it. I just, I don't understand. I think it'd be a great series, Australia, New Zealand, in New Zealand. Because New Zealand came here last summer, right? And it was one mm. of the dullest summers we've had in ages. Would it be great? Australia, Australia, I believe, tends to destroy New Zealand in New Zealand. I expect us to go there and win 8-0 in a two-test series. It's just out of sight, out of mind. So, like, we just respect those who beat us and we disrespect those who we beat all the time. It was like when I was in the UK talking with some English guys about who was better out of Coley and Tendilka and there's like, holy easy. Because Tendilka didn't score that many runs against England. They just mm. didn't see it, mm. you know? It's like, oh, but he killed us. That's a bit like, um, uh, slightly different, but like Gavaskar runs. It's yeah. 10,000 test runs. Out who? of sight, out of mind. Which one's that? Mm. <laughs> it's just fucking, yeah. Oh, well. Mohamed Abbas was good in the UAE, wasn't, wasn't he? Wasn't he? Yeah, nimble in a way. <laughs> really good player. Why hasn't he picked? Played well against us once or twice two years ago. But then Jim Bunny came to Australia last year. <laughs> like he bowled three balls, the key was up to the stumps, and he was injured. And he's won like 105 Ks, and we're like, oh, okay. Got it. I recognise this now. Yeah. Playing fours. Good bowler. 